In this video, we'll take a look at the Level Crossing app. The graph here displays a signal that ranges from 0 to 100 millivolts, and I'm interested in finding the x values where the y crosses a certain threshold. So with the graph active, let me click the icon for the app. A dialog opens. I will simply accept the defaults and click OK. You see a region of interest rectangle which can be resized if you want to analyze only a partial uh, data or you can expand it to cover your entire data set. The red vertical line here can be dragged to set the threshold level. If you want a precise threshold, you can click on the arrow, bring back the dialog, go to settings and type in a value such as say 50. The app reports how many crossing points were found, both where the crossing happens from a lower value to higher or a higher Y value to a lower Y value. Once you are satisfied with the settings, you can press this triangle button again and ask for output. That generates a report sheet where all the crossing data point information is saved, including the X value, X index, and the direction of the crossing. Let me close this book. Now let's take a look at another graph where I have three signals plotted. So if you are interested in performing the analysis for multiple data sets, simply plot them together in a single layer and bring up the app. Again, you can set the uh, range of um, the analysis in X and set the desired threshold value and simply click new output for all curves. And then the output sheet will have the data for the crossing points for each of the signals in the graph layer. We hope this app is useful to you. If you like the app, in recent versions of Origin, simply right click and choose Send Feedback. This will open a dialog where you can type in the feedback and also give us a rating and click the Submit button. Thank you for watching.